Hello, I am Dr. Joshua Nichols, and I am going to talk about the fundamentals of nature. If you would follow me, please. We will go down to the steps. We'll start here. This is called mold, and mold is black, and Mulch. What? Mulch. Oh, mulch. I said mode. Mulch. It looks like this. It smells a little odd. Or because it doesn't really have a smell. Okay. Follow me here. This is a flower. This possibly is a dead flower since this is cut off. It doesn't have a smell. That's unusual. Let's go here. Oh, look. A good example. This is called a spider web, made from the insect titled the spider. And they trap other bugs that they eat. There. And here is another fundamental nature the daddy long leg. Almost like a long spider. They're supposed to have eight legs, I believe, possibly less, but this one only has five. Maybe there was something that happened in that Daddy Longlegs family in the passing times of nature. What I am walking on are rocks. Rocks are hard stones. Bigger versions of rocks are called boulders. If you've ever seen the movie Raiders of the Lost Ark, Indiana went from the Indiana Jones series. Sorry, Rob. Here are plants or trees. If you look up there, there are tall trees. I almost illegally constructed an observation tower there because I felt the need that I needed. I, I wanted people to be able to see the town better, and I was almost caught, and I would have almost been arrested. Um, but that's a long story. Also, come with a pine tree. This is my favorite type of tree. When you touch it, it might poke you in a way. Ouch. This is a bush. The bush, sometimes they're not good to touch. This bush is like, as they call, bush head. Hmm. Yes, bush head is, you can refer to my, um, <laughs> I love it, my, um, my grandson, Josh. He used to have a bushy hair. And you could say bushy, because sometimes it, it's soft, big, and but sometimes curly. Like maybe these bushes. Here. Sharp plants. Ouch. Here. Here we have trees. Sometimes on trees they have broken branches. And this is called bark. Not the broken branches. This is called bark. This is the material put on trees. Obviously this one is most dirty and old. Maybe if I can We shall find more fundamentals of nature. Oh, I forgot about a fundamental, a fundamental of nature: air, oxygen, what we breathe in, what the earth is made. It's all around us. You, when you do this, when you move, every time you move. You feel, and you also breathe in oxygen that is part of nature. Over here we have some pretty funky looking plants here. Such as this one that has a big spider and their big spider web. Hmm. Let's pursue. Oh, grass. Grass is a good fundamental of nature. Grass is like most the most 
thing on land is grass. It's green and it's good for the environment. Very tall tree over here. The shoots and trees are, are shaped um, different. This one more goes in a slant up, and this one goes a little. I like trees, it's my favorite fundamental of nature. This gate, another fundamental of nature. This protects fundam a, fun a certain type of fundal fundamental of nature. Dr. Nichols, it's not part of nature. No, no, I will explain. Deer. Deer are a fundamental of nature, and they, this will help them not get through. This will help them not to go into this rich couple's house um, property. Here, big rocks. These rocks here are very big. You know. Here. They also come in interesting shapes and sizes too. Some could be this big, 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 some could be this big. We're talking about fundamentals of nature. Here, you can see a leaf. Leaves are fundamental of nature. They are very, they are in the fall. That's why the season fall is called fall, because that's the season when the leaves fall off the trees. They slowly fall. I am Dr. Joshua Nichols. My flight is probably going to come. Oh, here they are. Just land here. And I hope you enjoyed these fundamentals of nature. Let's just come here.